Hi there, I'm Mary, Sustainability Specialist Product here at Heli Hansen. In this video, I'm going to walk you through the exciting topic of cleaning and reproofing your shell or synthetic insulated jacket. First, you want to check the care label on the inside of the jacket for washing temperatures and things to avoid. Next, make sure all zippers are closed and then add your jacket to your front loading washing machine. If you have a top loader, just make sure that it doesn't have an agitator in the middle. Then, instead of a standard detergent, you want to add your choice of technical cleaner, which you can find at your local sports shop. Follow the instructions on the bottle for how much to add and also avoid adding any fabric softeners. Now you're ready to run your cycle. Select an outdoor cycle if you have one. If not, refer back to the care label. And finally, dry your garment. We would recommend running a drying cycle on medium heat, but it's always good just to check the care label instructions here too. The heat helps to reactivate the DWR after wash. However, if your jacket is older or it's been through a period of heavy use, you might actually want to reproof it before drying. So let's have a look at that. Similar to a dirty membrane, a dirty DWR won't function well. Dirt, sweat, campfire smoke, and other things can compromise your jacket's DWR performance, limiting both the repellency and the breathability. You may have experienced this, for example, when a jacket is soaking up water instead of repelling it, or feeling a little bit damp on the inside. So if you've noticed that parts of your jacket are soaking up water and you want to add repellency, run a second wash cycle right away without drying in between. But this time, simply replace the technical cleaner with a waterproofing product instead. As before, follow the on-bottle instructions for guidance on how much to use. At Heli Hansen, we strive to make products that are long-lasting and durable. But to help them last even longer, proper gear care is extremely important. We're often asked when you should clean your jacket. And the thing is, even if it doesn't look dirty or has only been lightly used, oils from your skin can build up on the inside of the jacket. This clogs the membrane and reduces breathability. So in order to get your jacket back up to your expected performance level, we would recommend cleaning it at least once a year. A good shell jacket is both waterproof and breathable. It prevents water from getting in and at the same time allows sweat vapor to escape. Our waterproof breathable technology is called Helitech. Most waterproof breathable jackets also have a treatment on the outside face called a durable water repellent, also known as a DWR. This treatment is what causes the water to bead up on the outside of the jacket and roll off. I hope this was helpful. Thanks for watching.